you guys how's it going uh, I didn't film it because it was pretty chaotic I know it would be with all the bees that was in that big long Langstroth hive but uh, I've got it sitting over there at the house all the bees are in here uh, 20 frames worth I had six full frames of brood and then about four that were just kind of partial and sporadic because it was uh, brood, pollen, and honey uh, mixed in all those frames. But I've got all them down here in the bottom, uh, minus one or two up top. And all the rest of that up there is honey. They've, they've got a ton of resources in there, so I don't have to worry about them uh, going hungry. Not for a while. Hopefully this fall nectar flow will kick in here very soon i need it to to get here not only just to fill these top boxes up but to uh, i really want them just to kind of backfill all that brood nest and stuff and i may go ahead and just set another super on uh, each of these hives and uh based off what they bring in i'll either take it or let them well that stands leaning pretty good i would take it or let them keep it one or the other but i wanted to focus my attention over here to this this nuke right here i think it is a goner i see one bee in there kind of kind of digging around but uh, the other day i took that top box off of this very few bees left and i think i'm just gonna have to remove this hive that that queen is she just didn't get mated very well but we're gonna dig in here and take a look at it real quick see what's going on for sure and i'm pretty pretty confident that's what the problem is yellow because I lost my green marker. But look how tiny she is. She's just a little old little tiny thing right here. She just did not get mated well. know what I should do is I should just kill that queen and toss those bees in another hive. I don't want to give them any resources. They're, they've got enough. They should be able to do what they need to do with it. 
Maybe we should do an experiment. Maybe we should see if we can overwinter some bees in a two frame nuke. What I should have done was, well, no, I'm not, I'm not giving this colony any brood from another one. I just ain't gonna do it this time of year. It'd be best just to go ahead and kill that queen and get rid of her. I mean, she's just, she is not performing. That's all there is to it. I don't think she can raise enough brood to build up a workforce for the winter. What brood she does have is fairly healthy. I mean, I don't really see much wrong with it. Got a decent pattern, it's just not a big pattern. I know the wax moth, are, they're just gonna get in here and destroy half these combs and run the bees out. And there's too much space for them to try to take care of. Let me go grab something and I'll be back. Alrighty, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna use this queen castle since it's got three frame space in it. And we're just gonna stick in bees in there. I'm not going to give them any type of bee power. If they make it on their own, awesome. If not, you know, this is just going to be an experiment. We'll see how many bees it actually takes to get through winter, I guess. Nothing fancy with my experiments. Small colony. I don't have much hope for it, but it'll be fun to see if this queen can uh, actually get a colony established and grow, or if it's going to fail. Now, when I say I'm not going to supplement, I'm not going to give them any frames of bees. I'll give them a little bit of syrup from time to time, maybe. And that's only if they get low. So we're gonna see what you know what it takes for these bees to survive. Okay, so this solid solid frame of pollen right here. Not much on this side, but this side right here is totally falling. This is the queen with what breed she's got, both sides. give them uh, this frame right here has got some nectar and pollen in it as well and that's it that's all they get Got a few bees over here. I'm shaking that.
I'll get in there. I don't want to kill the last handful of bees this colony's got. She wrote. Like I said, this is just an experiment. We'll see what'll happen. I do not have high hopes for them. But it's nature. You never know. Nature is pretty amazing. Might surprise us all. If you guys haven't already, I appreciate it if you scroll down. Hit that like button and subscribe. Appreciate you all taking time out of your day to check these videos out. It means a lot to me. Uh, until next time, uh, you guys have a good start to your week, and I'll catch you on the next one. Thanks for watching.